Hello and welcome to Storytime with Laura, where she shares her real life experiences and some really just creep her out. It started yesterday when me and my friend watched The Bang Bang Club and it was amazing and it was great and the movie finished and we're standing outside. So I'm waiting for around for my friend to come back because she's talking to someone. I spot this man carrying a Maltese and it's a puppy and it's white and it's just so adorable. And he's talking to this lady and he gives the dog over to her so she can carry it. And I'm thinking, you know, I don't think they actually know each other. So my friend comes back and I point it out and she's like, oh, the dog's really cute. And she's like, oh, they probably know each other. And there's this other lady standing in front of us staring at the cute, adorable dog as well. And I'm like, no, I, I really I really don't think they know each other. So he, she hands back the dog and she walks away. And it's clear that they did not know each other. She just thought the dog was cute. And he started talking to her. And then the man comes over to the lady ahead of us. And she's by herself and she was looking at the dog too. And he walks over and he says hi. And she's petting the dog. And at first I thought he, she, that lady was waiting for him and they were together. But it was clear that they did not know each other as at all. So, yeah. She's petting the dog and it's cute. And me and my friend are still staring but we're like, oh my goodness, that's really creepy. Now I start to think, okay, he's just using this dog. And me and my friend start getting creeped out, but we're still kind of, we're still standing there and we're kind of talking and looking as well. Then the lady goes and he leaves and he comes over to us and he's like, hi. And um, I had to call my dad, so I was talking on the phone this time, so I didn't really hear what he was saying, but my friend's petting the dog and it's cute and it's adorable. But it's so clear that he is just going, hitting every woman or girl young lady whatever that is staring at his dog and talking to them and I get off the phone and I'm like oh hi blah blah I don't really talk and, he, and then he leaves so we're like I turn to my friend and we're really creeped out because this man is clearly just using his puppy to talk to women and so we're talking about this and then the man goes further off and he um he, he doesn't go to any other anyone else and he puts his dog on the ground and is letting him like or her I'm not sure like kind of walk around and then I think my dad is here and I have to go past him so I'm like okay um I'm dragging my friend along she's like no I don't want to pass him because she has to walk back um but I drag her along and then he's talking to someone else because they're standing in line to um, buy movie tickets and he's kind of talking to someone else and his dog's still on the f floor walking around and the dog comes towards my friend and she pets him and she, she's playing with him and then he calls back the dog and he's just using this poor sweet animal to talk to women and I don't know I've never experienced that I've seen in movies where guys use you know babies or like puppies or you know some kind of an object in order to talk to women in order to hit on them or whatever but I've never seen it happen or I've never it's never happened to me and me and my friend are really creeped up because this man is really creepy he's just he's, he's not picking one woman to talk to no no he is talking to every single woman that just glances at his dog and we were just really creeped out so do people actually do that I mean I've never seen it happen like I said but, I mean, don't, especially if you just talk to every single person, your people are going to realize really soon that you are just using that dog, okay? And it's really creepy. I mean, you're, yes, your dog is cute. But whenever I look at another Maltese, I'll always think of that. Oh, so, yeah, that's just gross. And, I don't know. Do you think it actually works? You know, oh look, I have a really cute baby. You know, ah, no, it's just strong. It's it's strong, okay? Concludes story time with Laura, where she retells real life stories that happened to her. And yes, they're real life. And sometimes they're creepy.